Welcome back live. We continue right here on the Ireland Contracting Nightly Sports Call, which is fueled by the Bordis and Bordis Hotline at 412-575-2600. So, we went to break, asked you if you agree with Ron. Should they reseed? If they reseed, instead of having these division games, for example, this year, one through four in the East would be Tampa one. If Boston wins tomorrow, two. Washington three, Pittsburgh four. So it would be Tampa, Pittsburgh in this coming round, and Boston, Washington. If Toronto would win tomorrow, then all of a sudden Pittsburgh moves to three seed. You'd still have Pittsburgh, Washington, Toronto, Tampa. You like that, Ron? Well, you know what? I generally like to reseed. It's, it's not so bad this year. Uh, last year, the two best teams in the East played in the second round. That strikes me as being wrong. And, and this year, Winnipeg, or Nashville's the best overall record. And Winnipeg's the second best, and they're playing in the second round. There's something wrong with that. Um, I, this year it doesn't bother me as much uh, because uh, it, it's not like the Penguins were the best, second best team after Washington. But I, I don't like the two best playing in the second round. Let's go to Adam in Brentwood. Adam, as promised, you're on the air. How are you? Hi. Two quick things. Uh, how come Benny Cunningham wasn't great like Ken Casper or Calvin Winslow? He was good enough. He was outstanding. Helped him and, win a couple Super Bowls. I was really saddened to see and him pass away yesterday. at the age yesterday. of 63, way too young of cancer. Uh, I remember some great plays he made oh. here, man. He was a tight end before his time big, in terms big of man. six foot seven or eight, whatever he big was. Man. What else? Uh, what's your opinion about the Flyers fans throwing beer on the ice? Disgusting. The the game? Yeah, they're criminals as far as I'm concerned. I agree. They should have, they, they should have somebody criminals. arrest them when they do it. That's, it's, it's an assault. But, you know, they, they seem to thrive on that reputation. They live down to it all the time. They're very – the ones who do that stuff, and not everybody. I mean, there's not 18,000 of them there. But the ones who do it are despicable human beings for me. Tom in Forest Hills. What's up, Tom? How are you? Welcome to Sports Call. Hi uh, guys, how you doing? We're good, thanks. I got like underground kit. The Steelers are going to trade <laughs> top draft picks with the Giants and give them Le'Veon Bell. Yeah, here we go. So yeah, they that, can get the Penn State. Wait, I mean, it's, yeah, it's, 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 no, Bobby, you know, it. it's ridiculous because they can't trade Le'Veon Bell. We've talked about that. No. <laughs> he doesn't have a contract, so you can't trade him. People think that Le'Veon, they want to get rid of him. They, they better get used to the fact he's going to be around for whatever it is, $14.5 million this year. They better get used to it. Yeah. The Steelers have made the commitment to him. A lot of people don't seem to like it. They'll learn to love it. It's only if, one if more year. If he scores. And by if, then, he may not have what it takes to continue at the same level. If he scores a lot of touchdowns and runs for a lot of yards, they'll love him. Louie in Newcastle. What's up, Louie? Hey, how you doing, guys? What's up, man? What is wrong with the NHL? They're going to they're gonna compete against the NFL draft on Thursday. They've done it every year. They've done year. it every year for the last three with the same two teams. I'll uh, be watching the draft. <laughs> you, you know what? You the and ratings, most people, and most people, the ratings. They don't want to. They don't want to have another quiet night uh, this time of year. They have one tonight. They got the one game seven tomorrow. I think they want to play as much as they can. They do. The hockey people will watch it. It'll be interesting what the Pittsburgh numbers are here because the draft is a national holiday in this time. Yeah, but the Pittsburgh numbers will be very much. Now the good thing is Penguins play draft. at seven o'clock. You can watch the whole game and then watch who the Steelers right. pick. But if you're interested in all the intrigue, the trades, yeah, I think more what the people Browns are interested do. in just the Steelers pick. Yeah, well, we'll see. Uh, last year the numbers were heavily favored the draft, and we're due for a break here. We're going to take it and come back with more. But I know you'll be watching, and when you do, call us afterwards. We'll talk about it right here on the Sports Call. Back after this.